Hey, what's going on, my friends? It's me, it's Ken. We're doing that Pearson Ken uh, YouTube stuff from the Broadway Con where we're having an absolute blast. So check this out. When you walk around, you meet all sorts of interesting people. You meet people that have booths, don't have booths, have panels, don't have panels. And some of the kind folks I just met are from Lines in the Sky. And here to tell me all about what that even is, is Callie and Dean. What's up, y'all? How are you? Hey, how's it going? Hey, nice to see you and nice to meet you. I, I was curious. I saw this shirt and I was like, what is Lines in the Sky? And now they're going to tell me. So talk to me all about it. Yeah, so my name is Dean. I'm the founder of Lines in the Sky. Oh, the founder, all right. I See? am. It is a production company that lifts up new writers of original theater in New York. This is Callie. Hi, I'm the artistic director. Sweet. So we basically give new writers an opportunity to produce their new musicals, new plays. We do a lot of concerts, 54 Below, The Green Room 42, just getting their, their work out there. That's really it. So how does somebody find you? What do they do? How do you like go about learning and working together with some of these talents? So a lot of it is through social media. We have our um, Instagram, Lines in the Sky, and then we also have our website, linesky.com. Um, we have submission pages, so sharing on social media, uh, getting the word out, posting on playbill.com, our auditions and submissions, and that's how we're able to kind of build an audience and uh, people who are interested in one supporting us and two uh, working with us. Nice. So how, I guess the question is, how do you decide who to, who to do? Because, all right, the, the term social media influencer is a lot of, a lot of folks talk big and they might have the numbers but really nobody cares and I, I've been doing media for a long time and um, so it's interesting to see like okay yeah this one's louder than the other one but they ain't that good and there's really it's a kind of phantom following so but how do you so, decide the only criteria to submit to us is that it has to be original so it can't be based off a movie no books no jukebox musicals it has to be completely original and we go through all the submissions we get and if something speaks to us, you know, we'll, um, we'll talk to the writer about what they want to do with it, where they want to take it, where they want to see it, and how we can help them get it to that point. And it's good that you're doing it at 54 Below. I've talked to a few uh, people today. There's a lot of things that they do at 54 Below that seem in this pocket. So that's a good partner to have. That's good. Definitely. So, well, listen. I know you said you're running off to a panel, so I don't want to slow you down from the whole process. But hey, look, I'm going to let Callie and Dean get back to the business of business here at the Broadway Con. And as you know, lines in the sky is where you're going to find them. We're going to put all their intel in that whole uh, what's that section called? Oh yeah, where all the text goes. I don't even know what to call it anymore. But hey, I remain your humble host, the shy and bashful Ken from PearsonKen.com. Here from the Broadway Con, we'll see you next time. Bye.